mental agility. A telekinesis. Yay! Bisect did Briosis to set the squirrels and stuff on fire. You get health pickups, plus it's fun. Okay, you insane person. C4 Joe says, Donut Country is fun. What is Donut With Country? telekinesis, we can use our minds to grasp an object and then throw it. Go ahead, try it yourself. Get a good grip on it with your mind. Now, grab that trash can with your mind and hold it until I tell you to let go. Yes. Oh, <laughs> good throw. Now, let's see if you can make it through the hoop. You sound like my dad. Hey, I've been thinking about that. Why that guy hates psychics so much? What do we ever do to him? Well, psychics killed his whole family. Cursed them and all their descendants to die in water. Whoa. Yeah. Talk about baggage. Tell me about it. And the weird thing is, I'm pretty sure he's actually psychic himself. Ha! Huh. Cuckoo! Well, you can work on him when you get home. For now. Oops! My dad's oh, traumatized. <laughs> Let's see you do that again. Be the trash can. Be the trash. Oh, be careful now. Now, grab that trash can with your mind and hold it until I tell you to let go. Now, just think about where you want it to go. Bingo! Okay, last one. Be now, the trash. Now, throw that baby right through the hoop. Now, let me show you something. Pick that trash can up and aim your toss at the side of the caravan. Kablooey! Throwing something against a wall is a little more destructive than tossing it around on the ground, isn't it? Oh no! Another one of my senses! Now how'd that get in here? Looks like we're in luck. He doesn't see you yet. Why don't you smash him on the head with that handy trash can? Come on! Use telekinesis- I got it! Thank you. Whoa! Bullseye! Looks like the trash took him out. <laughs> Next lesson, we'll work on your snappy one-liners. All right, we're out of here. What are you doing? What are you? Okay, you're telling me to go the other way. I get it. So let's go kill some squirrels and get out of here. We gotta go to the lake front. Where would you like me to take you, Agent Kruller? Time to go to the lake. It's time to go to the lake. Yes, sir, Admiral, sir. Bobby! Uh-oh. Look, I can explain. Sounds like you caught a bad cold. Maybe. But listen, I traced the psychic interference back to Coach Oleander's radio. He's been broadcasting his insane plot all over camp in his sleep. So he's really kidnapping children and stealing their brains to make weapons. Yes. Isn't that great? What? How is that great? Because this is an honest-to-goodness psychic emergency! And Sasha's not here. He left on some official psychonauts business. Mia left a note saying the same thing! Lily, a deranged man-man is building an army of psychic death tanks to take over the world. And there's no one who can stop him, except for you and me! Oh my god! Let's make out! Uh, what? Sorry! I'm just so excited! Have you ever tried Since that move? Since you showed up, Raz, things are so much more exciting! Sinister death plots, <laughs> mad scientists, hideous monsters. Make out? How long have I ignored what this camp had to offer? 
everything's new to me now, thanks to you. I mean, look at this flower. You mean, like, kiss? How many years have I been coming here, and I've never even noticed a cool flower like this before? Oh, you got duped! Oh, no! We just got a girlfriend and now she got eaten by a lake monster. Plus one if this has happened to you. Hashtag relatable. Let's get him! I can't. I can't swim. Well then use the bathysphere at the end of the dock. Quick! While the flipper prints are still glowing. Are you coming? I don't know how to drive that thing. Uh, I can't. I have to um, uh, check on the other children. Yes, yes. If the brains are out, they'll need supervision. And possibly refrigeration. And how can you not know how to operate a bathysphere? Haven't you ever been to summer camp before? Now get a move on before that girl gets overly digested. So one of the things I really like about this game is all the small details and stuff. Hold on, I need to set this thing on fire. terrible about that but if you recall earlier you could hear the coach like snoring on all the speakers and you're like oh that's a fun silly little fact and you're like oh, okay cool like whatever who cares like he's an idiot but really he's not an idiot and he was broadcasting his dreams through the thingy says my favorite really subtle joke is coming up. Okay, we'll keep out an eye out for it. Let's take the doopity doop and get out of here. The heart beating is really annoying me, and I hope I can get myself some health soon. <laughs> get in the goober, Ram. The fact that you can go into other people's heads reminds me of Inception. Except this came before Inception. So really, Inception is just Psychonauts, really. And also there's different levels you can be in the ocean. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, more arrowheads that we're stealing from Native Americans. Can I... Choose which powers go where, right? So I want to change which powers I have found, but I don't know how to change that. Oh, past cutscenes. How do I change the bindings for my options? No, findings. Oh, inventory menu? Aha! No, that's not it. Aha! Here we go. I wanna burn some some weirdos. some help. It's, it's eating my brain. What do I do? <laughs> Alright. So I feel like I, va I very vaguely remember this. Oh shit. I remember now. I need to have levitation. Telekinesis for this. Something's about to happen, so... Penis. 
Thank you for subscribing, Alkanovas. I really appreciate it and I appreciate you. Sorry I'm not immediately yeah. figuring out what I'm supposed to be doing here. Oh. Oh, we just hit the things. And the problem is solved. Okay. <laughs> boop boop dee -de doo My health is low and I don't know how to restore it. Oh. Thank you for subscribing, C4 Joe. Bro! You didn't need to do that. I appreciate it though, but you didn't need to do it. <laughs> Here we go. Yep. and C4 Drew. MVPs of the stream so far. Here comes the big fish. girl and no one gets hurt, fish. Man, it's gonna be hard to find a new place to give you lumps. Ooh, burn. <laughs> In case you guys are forgetting, uh, Raz cannot go near water because... Oh. Hey, hey. That helmet got spit at me in the brain tunnel. something in his mouth when he is sucking the air before the water collapses you. Is there a bomb anywhere? I mean the nails do, do something. Get, get good grip. my car audio right now. Make sure to be driving safely. Keep your eyes on the road. I'm not... Oh, I'm looking through the eyes of the fish. I'm one with... Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. What do I do? I can't see. Oh, I touched the water. I died.
Can, uh, can you guys see the looming hand? I can't see anything. What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do when that happens? Okay, when he looks up, what am I supposed to do? Like, honestly. I'm running away. But, like, I can't see myself if... I can't see myself if the fish fucking looks away. Hey! Yep. Go away. You guys see that looming hand? That's the curse trying to kill us for going near water. can't see myself if the fishman looks away. Yep, we've all been there. Yeah. Hashtag relatable. Plus one in the chat if you can relate to the fact that uh, if you... If the fish looks away, you can't see yourself. You lose yourself if, the, if, if you look away. Hashtag relatable if uh, your girlfriend got eaten by a fish and now you have to fight them in an underwater cavern of bubbled air. Yeah, everybody can relate. You ever just finally get a girl to like you, and uh, she won't like you back because she's been eaten by a giant fish? <sighs> if I could tell you the number of times that's happened to me. I mean, it's just never ending. You finally get a girl who, who likes you, and she gets eaten by a giant psychic fish from the lake monster. <sighs> Young love, am I right? <coughs> Excuse me. I've been having this low-grade cough for like a few weeks, which is the most boring fact I could tell you during a Let's Play. And by the way, sorry if I complain a lot about Dying Lock. It's because I'm bad at video games. And, uh, hi. I love the little... F that the hands get more and more distinct the closer I get to the edge. And if I move away, you can't see them as much. It's cool. I think it's super neato. He's spitting out all the things. Alright, suck it in. Suck it in, boy. left and right here, like, no luck. This is a really long boss fight. This is the boss fight is way too long. It's too many stages. I wonder if I can throw this? Can I do any damage whatsoever to this big boy? Neato! Yep. Welcome to a speedrunner's worst nightmare. <laughs> unskippable unskippable cutscenes mid-boss fight. So I was watching this video by Apollo Legend yesterday. And while I respect the craft, obviously, and think it's super neato. Whoa, 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 whoa. Ugh, you almost got me there, you little sucker. Uh, oh, shit. Shit, 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 shit. Go, Raz, run, 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 run. Go, Raz, run. Ooh, ooh. <sighs> anyway, I respect the craft. It just sounds so fucking nerdy when he was talking about how the Smash Box is, like, unfair and shit. And he was like, and then on the left side, that's where it gets interesting. <laughs> and you're like, okay, dude. The Smashbox is a modified GameCube controller to be a flat surface for um, people who competitively play Smash. And so basically, it's a GameCube controller with stuff, but it has modifiers in it that would make. Oh, shit. Uh, 
speed running easier, like getting small angles much easier and stuff. And so he was like talking about it. It's a genuinely interesting topic, but God, it just sounds so nerdy when he does it. So and it's simultaneously very interesting and very and very nerdy and very sexy. <laughs> oh, the fish is giving me a fair chance. Thank you, fish. Um C4 Joe, I think you would find that very interesting. Gaming subcultures be like that. You're right. They do be like that. Oh shit, what do I do? What do I do? Oh, this? Okay, okay, okay. I whip my hair back and forth. I whip my hair back and forth. This guy knew what was up with fashion before we even knew. We've been new. Look at this fish doing full on like fashion. Oh, what? Get the clam. Whatever. I guess you just don't want to obey the laws of clam. Come here. Come on. Watch it. What? This should count. There, I did it. Ah, oh, poor little thing. Well, that's not its fault. This was once just a normal sized lungfish, minding its own business in a mucus lined air bubble beneath a semi dry leg bed. <laughs> but judging by the work done on it, I suspect Maury has mutated it, accelerated its growth, and has placed an implant in its brain to make it do his evil bidding. Aww. Poor little fish. Thing. Yeah, go inside there and try to smash the implant. Use the psycho portal I saw you steal from Sasha's lab. Oh, Here we go. Uh, yeah. That works on big scary monsters? <laughs> oh, monster schmonster. That thing's more afraid of you than you are of it. Now get in there. Oh, we're understanding of monsters. Oh, poor little thing. <laughs> we're understanding of monsters in this game, and I like that. Why can't ever anyone ever be forced to do neutral bidding? <laughs> I guess that's what uh, people use zombies for. You know, zombification. Turn them into your brain slave. And they, you know, I will force you to do menial tasks like clean my room and do my grocery shopping. Oh yeah, this is where you are King Kong. There's a special easter egg in this level that I don't know if I know exactly where it is, but it's hard to find, but I think I'm going to try and find ah, it. Ah, top of the morning to you, ma'am. And good day to you, Officer Lungfish. How are you today? Oh, damp and happy, can't complain. And what are you and the wee one up to on this lovely day? Oh, just obeying the law as always. All posted directives followed to the letter. Ah, good to hear. Not a one of us want any trouble, that's for sure. <laughs> <laughs> Free the lungfish from the influence of the mysterious Kochmara. Oh no! Doglor's heading for the orphanage! Doglor? Give me the help. I'm big and scary, in case you guys don't know. So I'm moving real slow. That's okay. Hey, Gogalore! Down here! Gogalore! Excuse me. Were you talking to me? Ah, ow! My ears! I'm sorry. Ah, oh my god! Ah. Are you okay? He's dead. Oh, jeez, I'm sorry. <laughs> Don't worry. Every member of the Resistance is prepared to die fighting the tyranny of Kochamara. What's Kochamara? He's a giant monster like you, Gogalore. He brainwashed and enslaved almost everyone in Lungfishopolis. That stinks. So, hey, 
Have you seen any other humans around here? I'm looking for a girl called Lily. The government archives might have some information about your young girlfriend, Gogolor. Yeah, I don't know if she's really my girlfriend. I mean, I think she... I only meant that she is your friend who was a girl, Gogolor. To access the archives, we must first destroy the broadcast tower Kochamara uses to control the populace. Check. I'll go smash that then. Wait, Gogolor! In order to reach the tower, you'll need to pass through that wall of lasers. But you'll never make it through the lasers without our help. So are you gonna start helping soon? First, I need you to do something for the Resistance. Punch a hole in that prison and free my comrades! Freedom! 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 hoo Now, how about getting me past those gates? Right. We stole the shield power module from Coach Amara. It's too big for any of us to operate, but it should work for you. What is it? Ooh, barrier. Hey, is this gonna upset Cochamera and all your little brainwashed neighbors? No! I doubt it. Uh, no, no. <laughs> so, knocking down the prison and then breaking this laser shield thing? Nobody's gonna get mad about that and start shooting at me. No! Uh, maybe one guy would. But what is even an entire navy of lungfish against the might and revolutionary zeal of Gogolor? Wait, what navy? Meet us at the dam, Gogolor. For freedom! Meet us for freedom! Psychic shield. Good shot. Okay. Emera, save us! I feel so big. I feel so powerful. Come here, here. The peaceful city of Lungfishopolis is under attack tonight by a hideous, gigantic monster the terrified citizens have named Gogalor. The Navy has responded quickly and decisively, dispatching its entire tank division to neutralize the creature. Soon, authorities say, everything will return to normal or better. Kidnapping human children is good. Where is Kochamara? Here I am. Something's crying. This guy needs a duffel bag tag. Okay, we gotta find a duffel bag tag for this. This big guy boy. needs a duffel bag tag. Yeah, I can see if you're trying to get through this level quickly. It's frustrating, but I think it's fun. The moving slowly gives you the feeling of being big, and that's important. Because I'm a big boy. Hi, young knight. Okay, we gotta keep an eye out for a duffel bag tag. Remembers. Remembers is the thing. This game is some kind of fever dream. I mean, you're not wrong. Where it's siren. 
I would feel bad, but I know this is not real, so it's okay. I mean, not real in terms of the game canon, so then it's okay, right? It's fine. It's fine that I'm breaking everything. Oh, we gotta come back for the cobwebs. 100%ing this game must be frustrating. Oh. Well, things have gotten a little embarrassing for Gagalore. Recently surfaced information has strongly linked the previously intimidating monster with common low-life criminals. Earlier tonight, Gagalore broke some of his jailhouse cronies out of the slammer so they could enjoy a night on the town, popping pills and soliciting inexpensive car girls. <laughs> well, what? they're in for one nasty hangover. Our beloved Navy has come up with a high-tech new invention. Trucks armed with hyper-electricity. Kidnapping children do not harm the brains. What? Kidnapping children do not harm the brains? What? Oh, it reflects it. What? Oh wait, the tag's up there. We gotta go get it. Okay, so this is for a purse, which is fine. All oh, the health went away. Give me the health, give me the health, give me the health. I need it. Don't go in the water. Stay with me. The destruction and terror continue as the hulking, godless child beast yeah, carves a bloody swath through our helpless city. Our noble, all-volunteer navy has been surprised only by the senseless lust for mayhem that seeps from the twisted black lump of a heart in this creature, still known only as Gogolor. Gogolor! Though it loathes violence in all its forms, the navy has no choice but to activate its anti-monster turrets, which it guarantees are 100% monster-proof. Not get caught stealing children. Do not get caught stealing children. <laughs> Oh, I died. I'm bad at video games. Hello, it's me. I'm bad at video games. Oh, I can pick up the tank. Alright, we got to, uh, alright. Oh, I just walked on top of some people. I'm so sorry. Gogolor, what are you doing down here? I'm trying to get to that Kachama Tower thing so I can smash it. The laser tunnel, Gogolor. We have to get through that or we'll never get to Kachamara Island. But the I thought... There is no I in T, Gogolor. There is a me, yeah, though. But there's an I in Squish, so watch it. I'll go take out your laser tunnel, but then we're going to talk about who's running this revolution. Hold on, I think, I think it's here. I can climb on this, and then if I do this, or... It has to be the highest tower or something like that. I love you, Cockalore. I love you, Cockalore. <laughs> if you walk on the squid. Good lord! He's in Why does 
Doesn't the Navy electrocute him? Hmm. Yep. Oh yeah, I killed it! <laughs> Destroy the prison to feel to free the pilot. Okay, we gotta get this thing, and I can see a big boy over there. <gasps> trauma! Come here, Trauma! No! Lungfish, Opop Lungfish Opopolis under siege. Yay, we're friends! Yay! Oh, there's that thing! I've come to speak to you. Now do as I say! Oh no, we must rebel. <coughs> <coughs> I'm so sorry for coughing. Freedom! 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 So, this big monster, <laughs> is that the best you could do? Excuse me? We were short on time, and he is good at smashing things. Doesn't look like much to me. Come on, let's blow this joint. You're gonna hey, die. You're welcome. Sorry about him, Gargalore. He's been in prison a long time. He's the only pilot the Resistance has, and he has an excellent plan. Where's Fish Thanos? Meet I'm us Fish at the Thanos. Dam so we can put it into action. I am Fish Thanos. How dare you question my authority as Fish Thanos. I mean, what does getting the baggage do other than make me feel good? Do I get bonuses for this or just like, I'm happy that I made the baggage happy? <laughs> you guys are excited about the new Godzilla, I see. Godzilla! Remember when Godzilla was about environmentalism and stuff, and now it's just like, really big monster cool guy. <laughs> Hold on, I think, I think, the, the Easter egg is over here, but I can't be sure. Mm. Is it? Is it? It's not. It's this is not it. <sighs> There's one it's supposed to be on the tallest building in the level. I know that. And where is the baggage that I had? I saw him. Here he is. Here's my boy. You're helping the met the lungfish's mental health issues and that's its own reward. You're right. You're that's true. I should not invalidate the reward of just being a good person. Go away! I'm a good person! I'm helping you! Believe me! Why won't you believe me that I'm helping you? Jeez. Man, I am not gonna do well in the meat circus. <laughs> Judging by how I'm doing now, meat circus is not gonna go well. You may ask, what is the meat circus? You don't need to know. You don't need to know about the meat circus. Gogalore! Yes, I must crush you. Ah, now you see the genius of our plan, Gogalore. First we print flyers, then we spread them all over town with my blimp. Winning over the hearts and minds of Lungfishopolis in as soon as six months. <laughs> six months? You don't like our plan, you can come up with another one. Yes, we are busy. We have to select cardstock and then find a decent but inexpensive printer within the week. How very, uh, sensible. I'm gonna jump on top of your blimp. Seems like that's what I'm supposed to be doing. Oh, wow. My little feet get into the big... Well, yep. they're not a big little right Knock now. It wow! Off. 
Hey! We don't have a replacement blimp, you know. How are you going to pro procrastination on the revolution? I don't know, man. I do not know. Give me health orbs. I'm Gargalore! Stop hitting me! Leave me alone! I'm trying to help you! Don't you see that? Don't you see that I'm just trying to help? I just don't understand what the problem is. Oh, I can't touch the water. I forgot. I can't touch the water even in when you're just thinking about water. Why does the health have to run away? I just want the health to be near me, and I want to absorb it into my body. Oh, fuck you. That's what happens when you fuck with me. Maybe the Easter egg is over there on those buildings? I know it's supposed to be on the top. Fuck this guy. I'm gonna find that Easter egg, maybe. Give me health. I don't care about arrowheads. I just want to live. Give me the health. Mm. It is frustrating seeing him, seeing him move relatively slowly even though within the canon of the game we are making progress. Hmm. This is a one-way street, I see. Oh, I should've gone that way. Hmm. It's a building right up against the hill. I think I remember that in small detail. Wow. slowly thing is kind of annoying. Here we go! Oh my god! Jeez! Longfish and Lobato. La la la. I'm just watching TV. Oh no! Experiments! <coughs> oh no, I'm a big boy. Go do my evil bidding and some neutral bidding as well. What just happened? Lame Arena. This level is a little frustrating, I'll admit. 
Hi, Alpha Fi Alpha Fiend. Uh, my weekend's going well. Well, it's not the weekend yet. My week been. Ha ha. Reading comprehension. It's been okay. Thanks for asking. Oh, there's a big boy up here. I can hear him. <laughs> I'm ready for it to be the weekend. Me too, Louise Ann. I have to pee right now, but I have to dedicate myself to a stream. That's how dedicated I am to video games. Gamers, rise up! Alright, this is it. I think this is where the Easter egg is supposed to be! We're here with the star of the popular sitcom Trouble in the Bubble, Buddy Finn. Buddy, what's your take on the Goggalore situation? Is he Gogalore. just misunderstood? No way! I hate Goggalore! I can't imagine any one of my fans siding with the monster. He hates everything lungfish care about. Air, water, Family, the economy. Oh, he hates air and Buddy, water. You'll be happy to know that the Navy has decided to pull out what they're most famous for. Good morning, Brad. Let's get these gamers. So rest assured, we can all look forward to Goggalore's imminent death and to seeing you, Buddy, every Thursday night at eight, right here on LBC. Thanks. LBC. And I'd just like to add that if anyone kidnaps a human child, they should take them quickly under the lake to the abandoned insane asylum. Gogolor, come in. We okay. have commandeered these vessels in your name. We can put them in position to help you cross Cochamara Channel to get to Cochamara Island and destroy Cochamara Tower. The thing is that, um, although we have the utmost faith that you will soon contain the area, Gogolor, we... Uh, uh, we just think it best to, to uh, uh, we've decided to maintain our position out here. Just until you clear the area of all hostiles. Yes. For insurance reasons, Gogolor. Yes, that, and for freedom. <laughs> Hold on, I have to pee really fast, I'm sorry. I'll be right back. Return! My people. Looks like... Okay, we re destroy all the planes so the freighters can dock. I see. Rawr, I'm truly... Ooh, I'm King Kong now. I hate air, water, family, and the economy also. We all do. We all hate air, water, and the economy. Yep. And families. If you like families, I'm gonna kick your ass. Suitcase tag. That's what I need here. <laughs> okay, so I think it's this one where we have to get close. Hold on. No, it's like right next to a hill. Like it clips into a hill. So... Yeah, there's a picture of a one of the developer's wives. Oh, 
Is it this one? Is this it do it? No, oh, damn it. Nope, this is not it. Alright, what do I need to do now? What's my goal? Proceed to the tower island to destroy the radio tower. Okay. Uh -huh. It doesn't quite clip into the hill, but you have to clip the camera into the hill. Yeah, I don't know which one it is, though. Hmm. Well, it's here. I just don't know which hill it is, so... Well, we're sorry to report that the miserable and incompetent lung-faced navy is all but sunk. Great work, losers. Now, Kochamara himself will have to come all the way down here just to save our worthless hides. Authorities are calling for a big parade in Kochamara's honor after he clobbers the annoying giant Gagalor. And if the parade is big enough, Kochamara promises not to destroy the city. Brush teeth more often don't drool so much. <laughs> I love the little subconscious w little. Hey everyone! Here comes Kochamara! Kochamara! I forget that Raz is an acrobat, acrobat, so it makes sense. Give up while you can, Gagalore. I know it's you in there, Coach. I don't know what you're broadcasting. Look, Camera, does not speak giant monster boy language. The only word you're gonna need is ouch. My Ram! My Ram! Deadly Bangle Ram! Deadly Tiger Beam! Fighting Ram! Deadly Tiger Beam! Hmm. He's doing so a little Sasha finger wiggle. Sure get how to save up your aggressive energy, huh? Well, why don't I help you let it all out? No, my beams. <laughs> Mighty Ram Crossing. Overly intricate combination. Hard to avoid. Area attack. Watch it. Overly intricate combination! Hard to avoid! Area attack! Overly, overly intricate combination! Hard to avoid! Area attack! Mighty Ram Ground Vision! Watch it! Overly intricate combination! Hard to avoid! Area attack! People of Lungfishopolis, I'm sorry I let you down. 
Finally. Okay, Tower. Get ready for Gogalore. Plus, press X to disrespect. Uh, what do I do? Battle, Kachana! Climb the tower to destroy the an antenna. Ah, just look Norm. Okay. Whee! Here we go. Yeah, press an X to disrespect. No respects paid. Capital X on FC on FK Coffee. Yeah, good for you guys. <laughs> I wonder if those most Morse code things said anything interesting. control of this freaky toad. I don't need him to nap children for me anymore. I've got the brain of a little girl back in my lab that's strong enough to power a whole army of psycho blaster death tanks. Huh? <laughs> what? You've got the brain of a little girl? <laughs> I said in my lab. I think you've got the muscles of a little girl too. <laughs> hey, don't be sexist, Raz. <sighs> Good one. Raz, don't give in to the patriarchal assumptions. Just to. <laughs> God, I'm like really off my game today. Sorry, guys. Human child. <laughs> who is that? It is I, the creature whose spirit was once. Um. <clears throat> over here. Behind you? Yes. Oh. The creature whose spirit was once enslaved by the evil one. You have unchained my soul. And now I shall repay you, powerful human child. Oh, uh, great. Well, okay. Show me what you did to my friend Lily. By the drowned spirit of Oblongata, what? it is done. <laughs> Sexism was a good thing back then. I don't think so, but uh, I'll take your word for it, Camel Spider. When it is your wish to travel across the lake, you may return to either shore and summon me with that. Thanks, hulking lungfish. You know, you really aren't as hideous as people say. Rude. You may call me now by my true name, Rasputin. The name given to me by my people. And what name is that, noble lake creature? Linda. What a magical lady. Here we are. We've been encroaching on the milkman. Everyone's... Ooh, Lily's bracelet. We're encroaching on everybody's... Favorite level, the milkman. Have you closed, Cena? Hey, I was talking to you, jerks. 